For this problem, we need to find all solutions for the following system with complex coefficients. Um, so we're going to take the coefficients for this system and put them into a coefficient matrix. This is 1 minus i times x1, so 1 minus i. And this is 2i. Here's 1 plus i, and that's minus 2. Okay, now we need to put this, uh, put this matrix into reduced row echelon form so we can solve um, for x1 and x2. So I'm going to start by multiplying both the top and the bottom by the conjugates of 1 minus i and 1 plus i in order to um, get rid of the complex number in that spot. So this becomes 1 minus i times 1 plus i. And I need to multiply the same thing by um, for this one. So 2i times 1 plus i. And this becomes 1 plus i times 1 minus i. And I need to multiply negative 2 by 1 minus i. Okay, and I'm going to simplify this. Uh, 1 minus i times 1 plus i. The, that's a uh, sum and difference formula, so the answer will be um, 1 squared minus i squared, and minus i squared is minus minus 1, so that's plus 1. So the answer is just 1 plus 1 is 2. And this is the same, uh, the same product, so that'll be 2 as well. Here are 2i times 1, 2i plus 2i times i, and i times i is negative 1, so minus and this is minus 2 times 1, and minus 2 times minus i, that's positive 2i. So I can see here, both of these are 2, and this is 2i minus 2, minus 2 plus 2i, that's an i, not a 1. Um, the top and the bottom are the same, so I can subtract out the bottom one, just because they're the same number. Uh, and I can also divide the top row by 2. So our final reduced row echelon form of the matrix is 1, i minus 1, 0, 0. OK, so we're going to assign x2 to be t. And in that way, we can solve uh, x1 um, plus t times i minus 1 is 0. So x1 equals, uh, if we multiply this by negative 1, it becomes 1 minus i. So the x1 equals t times 1 minus i. And x2 equals t. So that's our solution to the system.